Hi, my name is Adrienne Woods and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about how to make an electric cello sound good. Now, chances are you've already picked a decent instrument. I love my NS CR5. I picked it for the sound, but I don't want to sound like everybody else who plays the CR5. I want to have my own unique sound. So I'm going to play it through a couple of different pedals, a pedal board, uh, a DI, and a couple of different amps so you can see the difference it makes to change the sound of the instrument. If you want to find your unique voice, you need to find a pedal or two, you need to find a good amp, uh, you need to figure out how to record your instrument so that it reflects your unique voice. So I'm going to play a little bit of Bach just so you can hear the difference in what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to play kind of some rock eighth notes. <laughs> reverb pedal and let you hear the difference. it's going to give it a much more direct and clear sound. This next one is my California Blonde amp, which is a vintage amp that I've had for a while and what's great is it has built-in reverb and you can really tweak things and you can also stick your vocal mic in there if you want to have a two-for-one um, but it has a very sweet sound <laughs> Pod HD 500X by Line 6. I've modified some of the settings to be more like I want them to be, to sound more cello like than guitar like. So this one is Clean Platter. <laughs> This one is Big Hall. This one is Ball of Fire. This is my wah sound. So those are some of the sounds you can get if you use a pedal board. You can get different pedals if you want. I find it's fun to have a multi-effects unit and like tweak them yourself. 
because once you get a pedal, you pretty much can't do much except turn the knobs and maybe get a sound you like. Um, but definitely experiment with guitar pedals and with bass pedals because you'll get different results. All right, I'm still on the Pod HD. I want to play some bass samples so you can hear a couple bass things that do work and one that doesn't work. So you can understand what I'm saying when it comes to searching for pedals that work. This one is called Peggy Rot Bass. for a bass sound. This one's called Wet Rock Bass. And I have a bass mode. Then you have Banana Bass and it sounds about as good as the name is. So you're going to have some things that work and some things that don't work for cello just because they're made for guitar or bass and they don't work in the frequency. No matter what sound you pick, make sure it beats all the tracks you play with so you sound like a rock star. <laughs> this tutorial. If not, suck it.